Hi, thank you for your interest in TPB. My name is Elise Echeverry and I am the current chair for the Torero Program Board. I'm very excited to share a glimpse of what it's like to be on TPB, so let's get started. Torero Program Board is one of the branches of the Associated Student Government. We are responsible for creating and executing events which serve the undergraduate student population. Our purpose is to enhance and shape the student experience. Each of our events should create conversations and address the campus climate to address the concerns of students. Our job is to be intentional and relevant when we program events. We don't plan events just to have them. Every event should have a reason and a meaning for everything that we do. Why do we choose certain vendors over others? Why this particular theme? It is important that we think about these questions to answer the question at large. Why does the campus need this event over others? And what is the purpose of having this event? We are student leaders. It is important to use our leadership skills throughout this process and to take initiative when coming up with ideas, planning events, and executing them. One key aspect of being on TPB is taking student suggestions and implementing them. While there are some limitations on the events that we can put on, it is important to consider the wants and needs of students on campus and how we can best support them. Torero Program Board is run entirely by students. The board is overseen by the TPB Chair, who sits on the Executive Board of the Associated Student Government. The TPB Chair directly supervises three Vice Chairs and the Budget Controller. The Budget Controller works with the TPB Chair to request funds from the Finance Committee and create the budget for all of our events. This person will be tasked with ensuring payments are processed and helping to budget how much money we can spend on events. The Vice Chairs are responsible for overseeing and advising the coordinators through their events. They advise two to three coordinators during weekly individual meetings. One Vice Chair is responsible for supervi supervising the Brand Manager. The Brand Manager is responsible for creating all graphic designs and images for our programs. The Brand Manager works closely with the Marketing Manager to coordinate the distribution of the flyers to the students. The Marketing Manager is responsible for maintaining the social media accounts, connecting with various campus partners, and developing creative strategies to promote events. Event coordinators are at the heart of this organization. Coordinators help to create, plan, and execute all TPB events. Coordinators work in committees of two to three members with an overseeing vice chair. These committees design the entirety of events from the name to the food to any activities and everything in between. Lastly, there is Street Team, which is not a position, but rather an organization of student volunteers who help at our events on the day of. If you're interested in signing up for Street Team, the option to sign up is during, available during the Alcala Bazaar. In a typical week as a member of TBB, you will be responsible for maintaining eight office hours a week. These office hours include meetings with one, one on one meetings with your professional staff advisor, meeting with your vice chair, holding committee meetings for your events, and working on tasks to help complete your events. Some of these tasks may include reaching out to vendors, processing payments, brainstorming event ideas, and collaborating with other organizations on campus to help execute and market our events. In addition to your eight office hours, you will be responsible for attending our team meeting, which lasts for about one hour each week. This hour does not count to your weekly office hours. During these team meetings, we discuss any upcoming events, work through logistics, discuss event ideas, and work through professional development. When we do have events, each member of the team is expected to help staff the event in some capacity. Some events, like the concert, require all team members to be present the entire time. Smaller events may have shifts which you can sign up for a given time. You're expected to support TPB events either by staffing or stopping by and encouraging other students to attend. There are many advantages to being on TPB. One of the perks is that there is a work service award which is offered to students. This acts as a stipend toward your financial aid and can be up to $2,500 a year depending on the position for which you apply. Being on TBB also means that you are the first to know about upcoming events, issues being covered in Senate, and can help make key decisions in the student experience. Want to help decide who the fall lecturer will be? Join TBB and you'll be, help, be able to help make those calls. One of the most rewarding perks is that you are able to help shape the student experience. You may plan an event that brings people together and changes their view about campus or others that they could carry forward with them for the rest of their lives. It's incredibly moving and humbling to know that what we do creates lifelong memories for others. One of the more fun perks is that you can are able to help be creative and come up with your own event ideas on the job. If you can dream it, we can do it. The sky's the limit. Well, actually our budget is the limit, but we can pretty much do anything. Be bold and think outside of the box. We want to deliver something unique to the students. Lastly, you will have much professional and personal de development over the year. This is an opportunity which you can put on your resume as a job planning large-scale events for the university. 
Applications are now being accepted for the 2020-2021 school year. The application, along with a copy of your resume, is due by Tuesday, April 14th at 11.59 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. We'll be conducting interviews on April 16th and 17th. There's a link to sign up for the interview in the application. Interviews will be conducted via Zoom. If you are selected, we will be having a brief training before summer break to help get you acquainted with the event planning process and to inform you on what events you will be working on. The time and date for this training is yet to be determined. Over the summer, you will be expected to work with your committees to begin planning fall events. You will also be expected to return to campus early to participate in our training and be available to help during Olay weekend. We will help accommodate you to the best of our ability by allowing you to move in early to your on-campus housing. If you live off campus but require housing during this time, we can work to provide accommodations for you. You will be expected to return on campus by August 24th, 2020. TBB is an incredible experience that has helped change so many lives. You can ask anyone on the team for their input and they will be more than likely to have a good things to say about being on the team. If you want more reasons as to why you should join TBB, you can contact me at eechiveri at sandiego.edu or any members that you currently know on the team. Thank you for watching our informational. You are now ready to begin the application process. When asked on the application what the password is, please enter DIEGO in all capital letters. If you have any questions about TBB or the application process, please feel free to email tbb at sandiego.edu. We look forward to reviewing your application.